fast. Well, it's a bit disappointing. I thought West Coast was sensational. Um, probably, that, I think that Luke Power goal mm. just brought a three-quarter time, took a little bit out of the, the wind out of the sails, and then we know Johnny Worsfold, as uh, Lee Colbert said, was pretty dirty that he's on his way down on the ground. They kicked goal in ten Play seconds. So, Rich was in the way of Kerr. Quick hands from Johnston. Lewenberger throws it on the boot. Staker tapped out by oh, Butler. Right, smart, right. Redden was in the way. Favola is in everything at the moment, but he's not kicking goals. Not off the ground again. Down to throw it. Oh, now I hope that's cramped. Cramp. Yep. This could be a trivia question in a few years to come. Which Lions player didn't go down with cramp in round <laughs> one 2010? Hard to pick uh, up. See that. Oh, yeah, no, that's cramp. I think I know where I'd be going if I, uh, Michael Voss. No, oh, you... Good work by Banfield. He set that up and gave it to Staker. He's a player. He is a player, Banfield. He's a player because he's got poise. He's got pace. He's made some mistakes. Probably just the, the step up in the tempo from uh, AFL Queensland competition last year. It is a very different pace, but he's made some very good decisions under pressure. Just hasn't executed his skills as well as he would have liked, but that'll come as he picks up the tempo of the game over the next few weeks. He's going to play plenty of football, and good to see a bit of reward for effort for Brent Staker as well has been good. I think that's a great term. He's a player. You know, he doesn't look... He's, super, he's quick. Rossini's quick, and he lacks a bit of polish, but we know he's going to get that with the experience thinking the times there. But I just love the way he's got an urgency about his game. He wants to be involved in the game, and not many youngsters have that. They might find it once they get a high possession rate. But, uh, gee, it's been a great route. Yes, it has. And Redden gets it out wider, looking for Riscatelli. 37 is the margin. The West Coast Eagles led at every change. Daniel Rich does the ruck work, gets a tap out, put that in the book. Well, that's a free kick, isn't it? I oh, know, it was some boundary throwing. Throw oh, no. throw yeah, if you knock it over on the full sure. from a throw in or a throw in and also a throw ball up, is it? Ball yeah, up. ball up, sorry, only a ball up. Yep. It's a free the kick, but they said there was a double hit there. Oh, problems with the P and the whistle. Drummond's the loose man in defence here, just trying to get in front of the lead of Kennedy. Good kick. Oh, that's a free kick. Unrealistic attempt. Unrealistic attempt. Yeah, that was. <laughs> it was about 15 seconds early. Yeah, <laughs> and that was the spot where Drummond was just positioning himself, knew the ball was going to go long, read the ball extremely well, so dropped back into that hole and took the space where Kennedy won the jump. Staker or Clark. Oh. Staker went early and Clark just marked it. Talk about unrealistic. He's had a crack. Well, Mitch Clark's Good worked jump. his way back in the game this last quarter. And, and I think Lewenberger started it off. So well done to both young Ruckman to get some control where they were dominating the first half of football. Favola was just standing and waiting. And Butler with the spoil. Sure, I'd Butler. Be I'd be, I, I, they probably cannot take Fev off because they haven't got players to bring on, but... If they had someone on the bench, I think they'll be taking him off with a uh, cramping. You'd be telling oh, Brown and sure. Favola just to uh, stand back in the goal square. Well, Brownie looks like he's moving better. Get Fev back to the square and bring Brownie up. Banfield missed it. You said about Lewenberger and Clark coming back into the game. I think the indicators were there early in the third term with the centre bounces where they couldn't get their hand anywhere near the ball in the mm. first half. They were competing much better and getting their hand on the ball. The clearances weren't going in favour of the Lions, but certainly the effort and the, the contest was certainly there from the Ruckman. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is now Redden. Oh, oh, steps right. around and spots a couple of players in the middle. Sherman waited for it. He was third in the queue, though. Brown just paddled it back. Butler gave it to Selwood. Wider from him. Whoop, Sherman's in the way. Brown off a step. No one there. Not yet. 
Butler again to Mopa. Yours! Hold it, Travis. Set your back. Play on. And the Eagles work it out. Richard Telly down with Cramp. Again. <laughs> Lewenberger back and hit and hope. Rich has a runner. Reigns got to find a target. Missed. And might fall for stake it up. Controls it. Shows it. Gives it off. Redden runs himself to 50. And kicks it back. Gee, he's shown some poise too, hasn't he? A couple of times sold the dummy. He knows what's around him. Should have finished a bit better then, but. Getting late in the game, tired legs. Late last year, we saw Redden uh, yeah. play some games and showed plenty of class around the midfield, pushing forward, knows how to find space, knows how to use the ball. Shamo, that's it. Inside the last minute, it's a 38-point margin. Apologies to uh, people watching. My voice hasn't been as uh, good as it should have been tonight, but that's... Um, I thought it was Frankie Costa. Uh, it's a long taken over. One of these infections that always seems to come up on the weekend, Charlie. Yeah, yeah. You've toughed it out, though, man. Yeah, well, Courageous mate. effort. It's not a frog in my throat. It's the entire cast of Shrek. <laughs> As the kick came across from Lynch. Cox, worried by power. Good effort, Luke Power. Good effort, Luke Power. Just have Redden just turn it up from 50 metres. And just... In the background there, Brendan Favola was not happy at all. Oh, come on, Fev. <laughs> I think he's had a feeling. I think he's been in the limelight. And the West Coast Eagles kick a goal on the siren. The last goal of the game for the Eagles, making the final margin 32 points. And a big last quarter for the Lions. Gives them the win in round one. Well, they'd be absolutely over the moon, the Brisbane Lions, after three quarters of a game. They were just toughing it out, and they were doing it fairly tough, actually. The West Coast Eagles had plenty of run. They seemed to have plenty of pause, but they didn't have the legs to challenge the Brisbane Lions. And it was the key forwards who were on the end of some fantastic work up the field through the midfield that just worked hard. Staker was a good player in his first game for the Lions. Jonathan Brown was a fantastic player. Brendan Favola was a good one in his first game. Had a few shots on goal, missed a few shots. Three goals, seven for Brendan Favola. And uh, I think he'd be reasonably happy with his first game. And he's actually joined Lee Colbert in the middle of the ground. Well, he is pretty happy, Lynchy. But, uh, mate, you had midfield possessions tonight. You had about 18 touches, but uh, the radar was a little bit off. Yeah, the radar was off, mate. So hopefully I can get that right throughout the year. But we had a lot of goal kickers. We had a lot of scoring shots. But it's a bit dewy up here in Brisbane. So I'm going to get used to the, uh, the wet hands and... Uh, uh, it was a great win by the boys, and um, I think we were two or three men down in the second half, and to fight like that proves that we're a fit group. And short term,